Hi everyone. I am Dr. N. Sabrin, Assistant Professor, PG Department of Commerce, Jamal Muhammad College, Trichy. Now we are discuss about import export procedure, introduction to international trade. What is international trade? That means international trade is the exchange of goods and service between the countries. A product that is sold to the global market is an import and a product that bought from the global market is an import. International trade is considered as the foreign of growth. Next we discuss about the features of international trade. The first point, immobility of factors of production. That means uh, within a country, the labor and capital move freely to get maximum returns. These factors of production do not move such a freedom among different countries due to new culture, climate, language, customs and political restrictions imposed by the state. These mobilities give rise to wage and interest rate differential among the countries. Next point, geographical of climate difference and difference in national resources endorsement. That means each country has its unique climate which is responsible for agriculture product of that country. For example, Rajot from Bangladesh Natural resources endorsement is allow Gulf countries to produce oil. Australia with the vast expenses of land produce wheat, uh, mutton and wool. Next point, difference in market condition. Each country has verifying market features of weight of uh, measures and language, fashion, taste. Parties to international trade needed to study these features of the country within whom they wish to the trade. Next point, difference in currency system. So that means while traders can transact in the rupees while trading in India, he has to transact the dollar, bounds, euro or yuan while trading with the USA, UK and Japan respectively. These introduce additional cost of risk in international trade as the value of currencies in subject to the variation. Uh, some currencies are easily convertible into others but not all. Next point, higher transfer cost. Higher transfer cost means uh, because of the long distance involved uh, transport transport cost for international transaction or higher, higher than for domestic trade. Next point, different political system. That means in domestic trade parties, large transactions with due to regarding to uh, national interest, such loyalty is absent in international trade. As each party aim at maximum gain for itself. Next point, different trade policies. Uh, that means in terms of the commerce taxation, export or import, the tariff, the tariff is a single policy covering the transaction under the domestic trade. This is not the case with international trade parties have to study and adopt the policy of both the countries involved in the trade. Next point, the problem of balance of payment. That means some countries is especially developed ones want to import the uh, sub sustainable capital goods uh, from overseas to build infrastructure for growth of their country. Uh, the which supply the goods are not always in a capacity to buy the equal of goods and service from these developing nations. Uh, the, the developing countries in a uh, position to match the other export within with import. Difference between uh, domestic trade and international trade. The first factors, area served. Area served, the domestic trade is very small and area served, international trade is very high. And business generations, business generation is domestic trade in single country 
and business generation is international trade more than one country and next factor the risk factors the risk factor domestic trade is low and the risk factor is international trade is very high and next factor the nature of a customer nature of customer is domestic trade almost the same a nature of the customer in international trade is variation customer taste and preference and next factor the capital requirements capital requirement is domestic trade is less and capital requirement is international trade is huge and next factor language and culture uh, language and culture is domestic trade is one language and culture and language and culture is international trade many language and culture and next factor the role of uh, polities uh, the role of the polities uh, the domestic trade the political factors are minor important and the role of uh, political factor is uh, international trade the political factor play the uh, vital role and next factor financial climate uh, the financial climate is domestic trade uniform in financial climate but the financial climate is international trade is a very uh, variety of the financial climate create and next factor the knowledge requirements knowledge requirement is domestic trade is management knowledge is required but uh, knowledge requirement is international trade specific management on knowledge competency and next factor product planning and uh, developing the product planning and development uh, the domestic trade is according to the domestic trade and the planning uh, product planning and development is international trade is foreign trade according to the foreign trade and the familiarity familiarity is a domestic trade well familiarity with the domestic trade familiarity is international trade a lack of familiarity with the foreign trade and research became the essential next factor the government uh, interference so that means the the domestic trade is less and the government is interference is the international trade comparatively is very high and uh, next factor research and uh, the research is domestic trade is required but not to very high level the research is international trade is deep research of the trade is required because of loss knowledge about the foreign thank you